within us, there is a girl. Not like that. It's a spirit. Human form. Michan. Pink haired goddess? No goddess. Spirit. Great spirits. Awaken. Covenant. New powers. That's basically pretty much the important stuff of last episode of Spirit Chronicles. We got to meet the wilderness people. Demi human is a slur. We got to call them child of the beast or something. And we're just kind of chilling for the most part. Now, the very peculiar thing that happened at the end of last episode had to do with that guy, the quote unquote ambassador from the different empire that showed up to, you know, try to do some shit with Flora during the kidnapping in like the first couple episodes. He took like a dragon egg and then he left. Where's he going? There's a bunch of dragons chasing us. Is his plan to basically have this aggro and bait the dragons to like destroy the kingdom or something? Let's begin today's reaction. One year time skip. What are we now, like 13? Oh. We're like an honorary member of the village. Dry ass. Soundtrack is cool. The hums. Kiss. Choo. The blessing of the dry ass. Let's drink. Festival night. I wonder if that dude is bringing the dragons to Rio. How would he know though? Because like my guess on whether like how why he aggroed the dragon, like I thought about it last night. I'm like, what if he's trying to like bring them and just like drop the egg off somewhere and then the dragons will just like wreak havoc on some sort of place. But she shouldn't know that we're here right now, right? I don't know. Part of me hopes that they're gonna drop it on Stewart's dumbass. Girls around Rio. Oh, she's slurring. She's slurring. Everybody's drunk. Latifa sober. Deep in friendship. These girls just wish that they had a harem MC that would just touch them all over the place. But Ryo, he doesn't want any of that. He's like, he's kind of like Bell Cronel, right? He's like that like super kind, maybe idealistic person who doesn't just go around abusing his, I don't know, ability to attract girls. These girls look like 10 years old, man. The fuck are they drinking? <laughs> different society, different world, different rules. Latifa gonna get drunk. What if she try to make some moves on us tonight, bro? Oh, Ursula Baba, you gonna make a move? Sad episode? Is she gonna be crying a lot when we leave her? Hey, it's him again! So I guess the whole pulling the dragon aggro had no meaning. Unless they made so much distance that like they're still on its way, I doubt it. I really thought that he was gonna pull aggro and drop it somewhere else, but if they're gonna be resting here, it's no, they're they're good. <laughs> Swallow it. No! Protection? This is the shit that he crushed! And then the dude died! The dude that was gonna be a liability to leak the information in the first episode, right? That's what he fucking did, and then he died! Yeah, and it's a bomb! It's a bomb! Don't do it! Don't, no. I mean, he has sworn like allegiance to this new group, right? I mean, I guess he gotta do what boss tells him to. Bro, you gonna die. 
あちらへ向かってくれれば、私も。Those eyebrows are crazy. くれぐれもお願いしますよ。Flying spirit arts? そろそろ卵を持ってくる頃合いです、ね That means that he is also using spirit arts, right? So he must be. I don't know. I don't know what qualifies a person to be like a spirit art user other than people from, you know, the wilderness here and maybe Yakumo. There's a dragon. Okay, so he pulled the. What is, the what is the logic? He pulled the aggro, and then the bait is his own. Guy with the egg and the griffin. What's you? What are you planning? Will the egg hatch faster because of this? I don't know. Also, the area seems to be pretty close by, right? If she can sense something is up in the sky, like the dragons are pretty nearby the wilderness, too. <laughs> and the guy did say, run in that direction, right? He said, go in that direction. I'm sure that direction is where our village is. So the idea is dragon comes and he goes that direction and then we lead into the village and then bada bing bada boom done. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, about that. Ratifa. The dragons will show up and disrupt this conversation. Yeah, I think he can definitely see the big tree because spirit art users can, you know, see the big tree, and he was already flying, which means that he's a spirit art user. Oh shit! I thought they would disrupt this convo. You want to come with us, Latifa? Didn't stop you until now. Uh oh. She might get in trouble with the dragon shit though if she goes in that direction. Dry ass notice. And they sobered up real quick. I thought they'd be still drunk. It was all an act. The girls were acting drunk. I, how many hours has it really been, bro? What the fuck? They were slurring. Like, oh, oh, oh. They were just trying to do that to get in bed with Rio. That's a lot of eggs. Faculty is a pursuit. You're intelligent. I see more eggs. Maybe dragon eggs. So he took one egg and left. Baited all the dragons to go out, went back, and now he's gonna collect them more? But who's he talking to? Who's the you here? Faculty. This guy is scheming. Where's it going? I don't know, the, the eggs are going down. I got no clue. This guy really confuses me a lot, but maybe he was just talking to the dragons. It doesn't really make sense to me that dragons would be intelligent, being speaking, and you know, having faculty of research or something. Maybe some other humanoid was like doing experiments within this dragon cave, but. The I don't know. It looks like it's just going into the ground, right? <laughs> I don't know. He's harvesting the eggs, I think. Uh oh, Griffon. Yeah, tell Uzuma that first, bro. She's jumped us. I feel bad for this guy, man. Uh oh. Dragon egg. Yeah, it's time for him to make a run for it. Lightning? Miss, miss, miss. And the dragons right now. Oh shit! Here we go. They jumped real so fast before. But they couldn't prevent this guy. And now we our village is gonna get fucked up. <laughs> oh wyverns, not dragons. Remember, what is the difference between a wyvern and a dragon? 
A dragon has wings sprouting from its shoulder to back, but a wyvern has the wing as an attachment off of the arm. How do I know that? I got really high one night and read an entire fucking like Elden Ring wiki and just did research about dragons and wyverns and worms. No, no, no. That's a worm. No, no, no. A worm, W-Y-R-M, are beings that once borrowed dragon power, but then the curse is after a while, you become corrupted by it and you become like this like grounded dragon that can't like fly. You're just like this ground lizard. That's a worm. Yeah, 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 yeah. For some reason, the Elden Ring lore said that, like, I don't know, I know I'm getting off tangent, but I, I find this fascinating. Like, humans who took dragon blood to have some sort of powers, eventually a long time later, they would turn into worms. It's like a sort of like a punishment, like a curse. What about Subaru? <laughs> this Subaru is not going to turn into a worm. <laughs> totally different fucking lores. <laughs> Rio will just save the day, right? All the eggs are gone. I'm gonna blow him up. I feel bad for him, man. Like, this guy, I, I feel like just got involved with the wrong crowd. I don't think he was really that bad of a person. He's just, he's just a pawn. At least a griffin lived. Wait, what? Spirits? Wait, 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 wait. Bond spirit. Okay, now we're getting to see the actual powers of like using spirits and shit. If they've already made a contract or a covenant. Ifrita. And that's what that spirit was? This is the big wolf thing we saw last episode, right? Yeah. Yeah, but in the tent, right? It was the spirit and the- yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no, Latifa, she gonna get in trouble. Egg. Oh. Mm. It's a dragon. So like, I don't know if it's like premature birth or anything, but there it is. <laughs> Run, Latifa. Not a CGI dragon though, huh? Hayaku,避難するんだ。急いでください。何かあったんですか、ルーシー。ワイバンの群れが近づいている。ワイバンが。Atifa. I feel like now is the perfect time for Michan as a spirit to awaken within him and to make some sort of covenant and to have some OP powers to save the day. She really scoring off against the wyvern. Rio. Spirit arts. Let's go. So you like fight along with it. So like, what's Rio gonna do? Cause like, we're not gonna be riding Michan. That'd be, that's a funny image. Think about like, we're just like on Michan's back, <laughs> flying into battle. That doesn't make sense. She'll do her own thing on the side. It's working. She did. The village is gonna get destroyed at this rate. Rio. Real. 
Oh, what's so cool? Yo, the soundtrack though. <laughs> Yeah, maybe we don't need Michan to awaken. <laughs> I thought this is the moment that we need the power of the spirit to help, but like, bro, just gonna kick his thing to death. Okay. Bare hands. He's just straight up to throwing hands against the Black Wyvern. Ooh. One ear, remember. Ooh. And then the breath attack still happens. Killed from within there, I think, right? Breath attack was about to happen. We just put that shit in there and then dunked it. So he's dead from within. There's a lot more dragons. No, they're leaving? Okay, I thought they would like sh all show up and you know try to start shit with this, but you know if the black wyvern goes down, they're like, ah oh, shit, we're cooked, we're out. So now we're a black wyvern slayer. Oh, yeah, I think the most logical thought is because the black wyvern the captain went down or they realized that maybe race is taking all the eggs back home and they're racing back home for that i don't know <laughs> Ryo just made the wyvern submit <laughs> wow but we still have to have that conversation about leaving now there was a dragon on the ground the wyvern hatchling maybe it's dead i thought that maybe it was like uh, going to be something that it could be friends with us, but maybe it's just dead. Wonder what they're gonna do with the blonde guy. The four eyebrows. Like... <laughs> do they have a proper burial? Do they just leave them? Like the fucking dragon fetus? <laughs> and the guy's just crushed body? It's just... Alright, whatever. We're, we're gone. Hmm? We still gotta leave. <laughs> yeah, we left because you're so annoying. No. Little sister zoned. Yes, yes, it's fine. I feel like in about 10 years you're gonna regret this. As he's surrounded by more and more women, and you kind of want to compete for him too, and you realize that shit, I sister zone myself in the past. It is what it is. Yeah, he's nice. Bye bye. We left Sedia, and now we're gonna leave Latifa. Who next? Mom. しんだりおしんのこ。初めて話してくれたね。お兄ちゃんのこと。そうだったな。イセカイ。信じてもらえるか。イセカイ。けど。あのね。イセカイ。イセカイ。イセカイ。イセカイ。イセカイ。イセカ
Koki matter here? Because Michan, it's seeming like she reincarnated as the great spirit within us. What about this dude though? I mean, there's no news about him disappearing, so he's probably just chilling. Or maybe he does exist, who knows? <laughs> Another girl left behind. We ain't sending letters to you, though. Yo, he should send letters. He's sending them to Seria. We forgot. I wonder how many letters he's been sending over the last year, huh? Maybe he forgot entirely. Who? Is there a mail system here? Is there a mail system here? Because it's like a pretty isolated region with barriers locked up. Like, maybe we ghost to Seria for an entire year. I don't know. <laughs> Oh. Absorb your spirit arts and cloak itself in them. Okay, so it's gonna be a busted ass sword. We can imbue with spirit arts our new weapon. Nice. Armor. Black wyvern armor, bro. Drip. The black swordsman. This is the getting to drip. Yeah, this is the final black swordsman drip, bro. You put that shit on. Let's see it, Kirito. Oh, space time cash? Instant transport. Is that what this is? Space time cash. Is this like you've been to one place? You can go to different places instant teleport? What, what is this? What is this shit? Huh. It's like our infinite storage. I thought we were gonna like, 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 as in like, I thought the helping travel meant that we're gonna just teleport. No, it's just help, help, help travel because we have so much baggage we can just put it in the fucking storage. Okay. Look at Kirito, bro. Fuck you, Uzuma! <laughs> I bet you still feel guilty about this shit. That's right. Everyone else is smiling. And her ass was intentionally not like joining us throughout the whole like time that we spent here. She really was just like always left out. It was these four. And even to the bitter end, they're all smiling. Yeah, I bet you feel guilty about this shit. Fuck you. Yeah, nothing. Say nothing. That's right. Bye bye. Next time, when's next time? I don't know. Black Swordsman, bro. Look at him. We're not writing letters to you. I'm sorry. Sadie hasn't gotten letters in a year. You're not getting any letters. I'm sorry. Bye. Aww. Post credit scene. Let's get it. Back at the shitty kingdom, Seria! Bro, she should be 18 by now. From 12 to 17 and now to 18. No growth has happened. Girl, you are coping if you think you're gonna get any taller. You have stayed the same size since you were 12. Get yourself a stepladder. Oh, Ryo, so cool. <sighs> So we really did ghost her for the entire year. Oh shit! Wah, wah. Because he said he would write letters, but it's kind of hard to deliver letters. Like, uh, shit. And that is today's episode of Spirit Chronicles, and this is pretty hype. Now, I didn't get what I expected, which was the awakening of Michan from within and then making some sort of covenant to defeat the Black Wyvern. But the Black Wyvern is probably pretty strong. But it's that Ryo is just so much stronger that he just barehanded this dragon. He used some magic spells and cool shit, right? But like, damn, bro is so OP. We had to have the obviously, you know, the uncomfortable conversation with Latifa that we're going to be leaving. But Latifa, don't worry. You're not the first nor the last girl that Ryo will be leaving. I'm sure more girls, even when we go to Yagumo, I'm sure there's going to be more girls that we're going to be leaving behind. So join the club. And regarding race, what is bro cooking up? 
What is bro cooking up? He's basically gone and just retrieved all of the other dragon eggs. With it, is he planning on building some sort of army? Is it like an important catalyst for something? This dude is scheming. The blonde eyebrow guy. That's the price of being stupid. It is what it is. That's for me. If you're still here though, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.